the Smothers Brothers Comedy Hour. With juggling sensation, Air Jazz. Singer choreographer, Tony Basil and her dancers. Comedy great, John Viner. Magician extraordinaire, Joseph Gabriel and his birds. New country star, Katie Light and the replies. Presidential hopeful, Pat Paulson. Billy, it doesn't have to call me Johnson Saluga. Everybody's buddy, Jim Stafford. And Larry Kanzler and his orchestra. Ladies and gentlemen, the Smothers Brothers! Thank you. Thank you. Good evening. Good evening and welcome to another evening of prime time variety. And we're glad to, that you've joined us for our, again for our weekly celebration of the achievement in the world of entertainment and performance. Tom, that's exactly exactly what I said last week, word for word. Tom, that is exactly what I said w what, weekly, don't, word for word. What are, you, what are you copying me for? What are you copying me for? No, I'm trying to give you some constructive criticism. I'm trying to give you some constructive criticism. I want you to listen to me and not repeat I what I'm saying. I want you to listen to me and not repeat. Don't repeat what I'm saying. Don't repeat Why what I'm saying. Why are you repeating what I'm saying? Why are you repeating what I'm saying? This is no way to start the show. This you're is coming no way out. to start the show. But Tom, you're ticking me off. I said, why do, you, why do you have to repeat what I say? Why do you have to repeat what I I'm say? I'm asking you a question. I'm asking you a question. You're not answering me, you're copying me. You're answering me, you're copying me. I'm not answering, what? I'm stating a question and I want none of this. What's your answer? I'm asking... <laughs> I'm asking you, why do you keep repeating what I'm saying? Because you're never wrong. <laughs> Sing out a key.
But uh, I really can't stay. I'm actually off to the post office to pick up a package. I think it's uh, another book from my book club. And uh... <laughs> that's right, I read. What, is that so startling? I happen, to, I happen to think there's a lot more to life than just watching television. You can read about it, too. Did you know that? That's why I belong to the Television Biography Book of the Month Club. The TVBBOTMC. I'm sure you've heard of it. And uh, let's take a look. This is the theme to Gary show. The theme to Gary show. Gary called me up and asked if I would write his theme song. I'm almost halfway finished. How do you like it so far? How do you like the theme to Gary show? This is the theme to Gary show. The opening theme to Gary show. This is the music that you hear as you watch the credits. We're almost to the part of where I start the whistle. Then we'll watch it's Gary Shandling show. This was the theme to Gary Shandling show. This is uh, uh this is my favorite one. This is uh, Desi, a book. And, and you, know, no, you know, they're making a movie out of this, and it's going to be called Desi, a book. Stan, he's the editor. Stanley, not Stalin, for God's sake. She's the writer. How's that column coming? You won't like it. It's still good. A romance at work. Have you spent a lot of time thinking about my sex life? Obviously, it isn't worth it. Just in Time premieres Wednesday after Hooperman. These two were certainly not cut from the same mold. They're Paul Rodriguez and Eddie Velez, the stars of the new hit comedy, Trial and Error. Tonight, the whole family can dare to win on the game that's filled with bills and packed with prizes, Family Double Dare. Starting tonight, America just may be a safer place. America's most wanted. Television's first weekly manhunt is a new weapon in the battle against crime. And it's sending America's most wanted rapists, robbers, and murderers back to jail. Host John Walsh, whose six-year-old son Adam was brutally murdered, leads this crusade against crime. David James Roberts, sentenced to death for the arson murders of the Patrick family, who returned home to find him inside waiting for them. During transport, Roberts used a Derringer to overpower guards and fled. Then, America's most wanted went after him. Your phone tips led the FBI to David James Roberts' hideout. Danny Michael Weeks accepted $1,000 from Pam Esther to kill her husband. He escaped from Angola prison through the treacherous Louisiana swamp. Since his escape, he's accused of kidnapping a woman from a Houston shopping mall. Pursued by America's most wanted, an FBI assault team recaptured Danny Weeks as our cameras taped this arrest. America's most wanted has already captured four fugitives. You'll see how crimes are committed. Hear actual eyewitness accounts and get the clues the pieces of the puzzle we all need to hunt down america's most wanted tonight